You are listening to Gorgas, you idiot. You think that's a thing that a lot of fat guys run into is they can't get outside of the fat jokes? Yeah, totally. Yeah. Completely. It's still happening to people I like. Yeah. Currently. <laughs> yeah. Right now. You're like, bro, you got to get out. Yeah. Well, it's like, <laughs> you got to you know, get out of the fat zone. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's rough, dude. Yeah. You don't want to see your friends pass away because, like, the only laughs they get are like, they're like, went to McDonald's, order the menu. Huh? <laughs> Folks, like, you know, holding the mic out to the crowd. It's been, you know, I have friends yeah. doing Vince Neil, but it's, it's, fat, it's fat jokes. Yeah. Why ya? Why ya? I ate <laughs> fucking seven hot dogs, and everyone's Why like, ya? oh my God. <laughs> um, you know, but it's like, it's not like I'm, I'm, you know, such a good person for not talking about being fat. I would talk about my cock and my asshole. Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> dude, it's not like I mean, I'm on a bigger, to greener pastures. That's art. Higher brow stuff. <laughs> that's art, dude. It's just I'm <laughs> trying just to not be fat anymore. Yeah. Um. And, uh, yeah, I'm, it's painful because I want to talk about, like, my mom dying, you know? Yeah. And that'll bump people out. <laughs> yeah. And so, oh, I've heard, I think I've heard that bit. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's ongoing. Yeah. She's going to be dead forever, so I have plenty yeah. to talk about. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, and, like, my analogy with that is before when I was just being a fat guy, I was like, hey, I'm a hot dog. And everyone's like, yeah, you are, buddy. You're kind of gross, but we like you. <laughs> and now I'm trying to not be a hot dog. And talk about like my childhood. Yeah. And so now I go on stage and I'm like, here's how you make a hot dog. And everyone's like, absolutely Whoa. not. <laughs> Whoa. Go back to being yeah. a hot dog. Yeah. This is fucking terrifying. Wait a minute. We do want the fat guy jokes back. <laughs> Be yes. a hot dog or don't, fatty. <laughs> yeah. All right. We don't like it. <laughs> so that's been painful. <laughs> Isn't that kind of part of like the whole process though? I'm still so new at doing stand up. I mean, I I've been doing it for like a year and you know, not some people are going. Oh, like, you sweet angel! I know. I'm so young and and nubile. Mm -hmm. You know, you sweet baby angel. A year. I'm just having comedy. fun, dude. How's, I don't know. I, it, totally, it's fun and enjoy and it because I just it is see fun. a lot of people like really stressed out. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean? They're, and they're they're like like because they're not they don't think they're where they should be or mm -hmm. whatever. And I'm just I feel like bad because I'm just like I'm having fun. I'm just gonna go do my dick jokes. You yeah. know what I mean? But that's why I just try to be helpful. You know, help totally. people record shit or whatever I can do. I think I start before I got actually went up. I just was like taking pictures of people and giving right. them to them. I mean, is that you how know? we met? Maybe I think so. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Well, no, well, no, we met at the the duck. I think one Indeed. night. Indeed. Yeah. Okay. Cool. And I was um, like, hey, you're that you're that guy from Kill Tony, dude. Yeah. And you're like, stop. Yeah. We I don't talk about that. Yeah. We're not talking about that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It was the guy that I you know. I, Thought I was losing weight, and then I stepped on a scale where it said you gained 30 pounds in a month, and then I said no, I didn't, and then candy fell out of my pants. <laughs> that was me. <laughs> was that planned? In front of Ron White. I no. forgot about that. No, was that, that was not planned. That was not. You want to, you want to know the, the truth? Yeah. The hard hitting truth. What's the hard hitting truth? Is that I was really trying to lose weight, and I for sure did, but I was fasting to get through that show so I could try and win as much money as I could. I was like mm -hmm. fasting in the sauna. After going super hard in the gym, eating nothing. You're doing like a UFC weight cut. <clears throat> Essentially. Yeah. And I knew that I was going to win before I got there. That's what I was like. I'm winning. Like, yeah. This is happening. And I texted my buddy who used to be a fat piece of shit, and now he's jacked. And I was like, hey, man, I'm fasting, um, but I'm going to win, and I know I'm, I know I'm going to want to drink after. What can I eat so where I won't like pass out or throw up? And he was like, you need simple sugars just to get your system like recharged again. That should give you enough energy where you can drink and not be like a horrible piece of shit. Yeah. And then I go there, step on the scale, says you gained 30 pounds. And I'm like, hmm, this is horrifically, horrifically embarrassing. And it said Trey lost to like 21 pounds. So something was, was that off? Something or was awry. <laughs> something was awry. And I continued to do the contest. <laughs> and I never figured out what the problem was. <laughs> Because the next month it said I lost 50 pounds when I put in considerably less effort the second time yeah. around. And by the way, this is just a fun little note. <laughs> this was my introduction to Austin. I didn't know anyone down here. Yeah, dude, I didn't know any of the you comics. Were here for like a week. I was here for four days. <laughs> and I was asked to do this piece of shit show. I'm sorry. It's okay. I was just it's, the fat. I was, that's, it's, it's, I'm was not laughing. At, I'm laughing at your analysis and commentary on the situation it's just the way that you talk about it, it's fucking hilarious i'm not laughing <laughs> no. at what happened to you it sucks you laugh but, but it, dude it, it was it, hilarious it, it, i can't believe that swedish fish fell was it swedish fish big old bag of swedish fish <laughs> big giant share size fell out i i didn't it didn't fall out of my pants i threw i emptied my pockets to weigh in and i threw it on stage <laughs> so, but no one really noticed that they were like oh i guess his phone and keys are on the stage now yeah. but after i lost lost and Trey got two hundred and ten dollars. That's what I was gonna say. Trey <coughs> won, got two hundred and ten dollars because he got ten pounds for every pound he lost. I appealed, 
separately outside of the contest on the show to be like, this is crazy, the scales are off. Yeah. And they were like, you're fat, you're retarded, you're insecure. <laughs> Get out and of all here. All of the internet was like, you're a liar, you're a psychopath, you're ugly as hell. <laughs> And I was like, I'm going to restart my new life in Austin. And then just get shit down my mouth by the entire internet. Um, oh, my God. And then when I when we did it another time and I won and I lost 50 pounds, instead of $500, the good folks at Kill Tony gave me a box of cookies. <laughs> That's funny, though. It's fucked up. <laughs> it's fucked up. And but then at its core, you're like, they asked me if you're I like, you sons of bitches. They asked me if I wanted to do the show again, and they were surprised when I said no. Yeah. But grateful because that shook the fat jokes out of me. Nice. That was me okay. being done being a fat comedian. So we're not going to, we're not, the, after that, you were like, we're not doing the, <coughs> the ha ha fat guy anymore. Yeah. Well, for seven months after, I was horrifically depressed and suicidal. Um, Jesus Christ. And didn't do stand up and just didn't leave my apartment. Yeah. After that is when the fat jokes went away and I became a human being again. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> but uh, I don't know, in some weird way, I needed it mm -hmm. to like sh get the fat jokes out of me, yeah, and also experience what it's like to be humiliated on the internet. Because yeah. now people like read comments and they're like, "We need content," but the comments are mean. And I'm like, my first exposure on the on the internet is everyone calling me an ugly, insecure, psychopathic liar <laughs> who's morbidly obese. Fuck, dude. So I'm like, yeah, dude. Let them go. Like, yeah. come, it was such a great insight into the internet. Well, now, you Knowing know. Knowing the truth versus how yeah. everything was perceived. I was like, oh, the internet is bullshit. 